I want to show you how to graph a star in Desmos, and we're gonna we're gonna do it by using your parametric equations, which involve an x component and a y component, both in terms of t. And for the x component and the y component, they're gonna start the same way. They're gonna start with one minus the cosine of two point five five t. Square that and raise this to, to S and multiply it front by C. Then we'll copy this over here to the Y and we'll add sliders for both of these. Then multiply our x component by cosine, and then multiply your y component by sine of t. If you want to see your full star, I like using t going from minus 10 to 10. It may it may be overkill. Heck do I care? It, it it gets the job done. Now, in terms of the adjustments, C describes the depth. And so I like to use 0 0.7. And then S describes the roundness. And I found 0 0.15 to work well. And I notice the star is rotated. And, and if you want the tip to be um, to, to be vertical with, with the, the waxes here, uh, you can define a constant, you could define an angle called call it D, and I find a 0 0.943 radians uh, did a good job, and you would add it to both your x, your, your cosine, and then you add that to your sine here. You can see it rotates. And so if you want to adjust a little bit more, yeah, you, you can just use your, your slider to adjust it. If you want, if you want something more refined, you can make your step size a lot smaller, and then you have better resolution. All right, so time to make a start. Hope you found it useful, and I'll see you in the next video.